The ARIS process mining tool was used to analyze the accounts receivable process using extracts from SAP. This covered a 12-month period and the investigation focused on cycle time, rework and compliance. The overall aim was to identify key trends, process performance and target areas for improvement. Utilizing the PPM capabilities in the ARIS portal, an expected end-to-end -end process diagram for accounts receivable was created. Once the data is uploaded into the tool, it shows us the actual pathway taken by the process. Using the connection scale, we can see what is actually happening on the ground and not just the happy path scenario. The true flow allows us to identify rework and variations to the actual process. Rework is whereby an activity has to be done again due to errors. The first business question we answer in our analysis is how client billing is performing. The KPIs covered in this business question are the cycle time for client billing to payment, number of invoices by company and segment, and finally the breakdown of client receipts. Currently, clients are taking 41 days to pay from when the billing doc is created. More granular detail can be seen through the company and segment breakdowns in the bar graphs shown. We can see the number of invoices by company and segment. Evaluating these shows us that IT01 and construction segment have the most invoices respectively. Filtering for cases where the company has received payment on shows that UK01 is the company with the most client receipts and construction segment has the highest client receipts. The second business question is how we can improve invoice creation process. The KPIs covered are invoices paid on time, total invoice value, and breakdown of cycle time between activities within the end-to-end -end process. Filtering for cases through safe selections where payment has been received and the payment duration is less than one day allows us to see invoices that were paid on time. This dynamically changes the widgets such as invoices by company and segment, allowing us to analyze potential problem areas. The average overall cycle time shows us how long it takes from creation of invoice to clearing of line items. The line chart shows the trend over time and we can see whether the cycle time has shown any signs of improvement. Breakdown by company and segment allows us to identify any specific issues that may exist. This value widget shows us the average time it takes to invoice customers. On average, the company takes 11 days to invoice. Once again, more detailed breakdown can be achieved through the use of bar charts which give us segment and company level breakdown. The value widgets in the Payment Analysis tab can help us answer key questions such as total invoice value and average invoice value. The final business question that we are looking to answer is how do my processes behave in reality? To check the process variance, we can use the variance filter with the discovery diagram selecting the most common variance to see the process pathways and analyze the deviations from the typical linear path. Utilizing the ARIS process mining conformance checker, we can see cases where the correct flow is not being followed. Breakdown by types such as invalid start activity, invalid end activity and rework allows us to identify problem areas quickly. The conformance checker also gives a breakdown on individual cases whereby we can see what is going wrong. In conclusion, the ability to add filters and selections within this accounts receivable solution allows businesses to answer various questions and get more detailed insights where required.